So we're here in the nursery today. We're going to give you a quick update on those baby chickens that got beat up. We're going to show you how they're doing and we're going to come up with another solution to this pecking order problem. Those dang big chickens. Darn birds. Yep. So we're going to get to it. Come along with us today as we go ahead and give you guys the update and show you guys our solution to the problem. Yeah. We had to separate these guys and quarantine them because the integration didn't go so well for about three of them, actually five of them because two of them got pecked to death. Show you guys how they're doing on quarantine. Let's come over here and check out these birds. Still there, but it looks like it's healing pretty well though. All scabbed over. Others are starting to come in. Nothing on this side. It was Nothing just on that this side. side. It's just that side here. Yeah. That one at least. This one it was the both. Both of them. Which side? Looks like it's almost tailed. Completely. Looks like she's getting really good healed and Feathers are starting to hide it, you know. Doing a little more with the butt. A little more with the butt stuff. Looks a lot better. Doesn't look like she's. Yeah, yeah it looks like it actually has got some feathers coming back. Mm-hmm. Sweet. Buddy. All right, so these guys in here, as you can tell, um, this one's butt is starting to heal up quite a bit. <laughs> Quit hopping on each other, guys. Um, the other birds, the white and gray ones, their feathers are starting to cover over them really well. So they are healing up very good. It's probably been about five days since we put them here in quarantine. So another week of quarantine for them and then they'll be golden to go back. Yeah, have, uh, I think so issues. too. I think about another week. I think that we should take those blackbirds and put I them in here, mile. just to separate them from. And we'll get the until eggs everybody there. grows bigger. So I think we're gonna take the blackbirds from the hen house and put them here in the green mile, at least until all the new birds that we have are fully integrated into the hen house. Because once they're grown up and they're fully integrated into the hen house, then those two blackbirds are gonna totally be outnumbered and it shouldn't be an issue anymore. I, it's really a guessing game. I don't know for sure. If you have a better idea, drop it down in the comments. But that's what we're gonna do for now to try to solve this problem. So all the baby chicks are in high spirits. They are starting to lose their baby fluff and they've got a lot of feathers these days. I'm hoping that when we actually put these guys in the flock, the main hen house, that they don't have such a tr trouble integrating like the other birds from the incubator did, but only time's gonna tell. Right now all of these birds from Tractor Supply are probably about a month old and so they have another three weeks or so until we move them into the hen house. As we know, time is gonna go by really quick, so we'll update on these guys later when it's move-in day for them. All right, let's go over to the hen house and let's make some different living arrangements for those birds that are over there and um, put them in a timeout because I'm not gonna have any bullies, so let's go do that. Right. It's actually a really nice day today and we've had nothing but crappy weather. It's a beautiful sunshiny day, not a cloud in the sky. Um, it's really nice compared to what we've had lately. So let's check on these guys here in the hen house and see how these babies are doing. I have not checked on them yet today so I don't know if there's any more victims. We'll find out right now. Eggies. 
and then the babies will be over here. One, two, three, four, five, six. Seven, eight, nine. Yep, that's all of them. All of them right here. Look at all these babies. Quite a bit there. They're not getting pecked on or abused in any way. All of their feathers are still intact. They seem like they're doing really well. Um, I think that the bullies have kind of taken over the yard and they've kind of self-quarantined themselves in here. Um, the black bird that he's poking his head in right now is the one that's the major bully. I have two blackbirds though, so I'm not sure which one it is. I'm just gonna take them both. They're both gonna be in trouble. I honestly don't know why those birds are getting attacked and these ones are not. So let's go uh, get those chickens and solve this problem. Yep. <laughs> Two birds, one hand. So we got the two bullies that were picking on everybody moved over from the hen house over here to the Green Mile and they can just chill out and hang out over here for a while. We do want to keep them. They are giving us eggs, but I just can't have them attacking everybody and killing off the other birds. So we will see. For now, this is where these guys are going to live and that's just that. All right, thanks for watching our update on our birds. If you guys liked it, hit that thumbs up. Or if you guys didn't like it, hit the thumbs down. I don't really care. <laughs> um, but definitely hit the thumbs up if you liked it. We love hearing from you guys, so hit us up. Make sure to uh, like, share, comment, subscribe, all that good stuff. And we'll catch you on the next one. Bye, guys. Later, later.